uh, she almost admitted to like, okay, these do look like shine. <laughs> like, uh, I don't know. Sheree, I love her. I still think she's the MVP of the season. I think she had the realest storyline, but she did. There you go. I mean, in other news, I'd wonder if we're going to see this on RHOC. Miss, is Miss Shannon Bedore celebrating because the guy, I mean, listen, David and her needed to get divorced, but the woman that he basically was with right after Shannon, like they just, pre- she had, she had pregnant, had a kid, right? Is, does she have the kid already? I don't yes. Even know. Yeah. Their daughter, uh, like two or going on three. Yeah. Wow. Cause they had the daughter qu- quickly. I think when they, after they got together. Well, they're getting a divorce. I mean, Shannon's probably like girlfriend. I told you so. Not David, but Doa. I can't believe you mean unemotional, no uh, expression. David Bedoa getting divorced again. How many divorces is this for David? Three. He just, he just, I, I didn't like him. I didn't like him. No one's. I don't. I mean, is there any fan? I challenge anyone to get in our DM. Said, did anyone like David? I don't think him. Anyone. Him and Jim Bellino are the two that really from the oh, those he just and Shane won me over. I had creepy vibes with Shane and Shane, Miss Shane Simpson won me over. Like he's he he ain't so bad. But yeah, so there you go. I mean, like Shannon has to be like celebrating, right? Oh, of course. I mean, yeah. And you know, Shannon says that she and David, it's still icy. I do wonder if maybe this um paves the way for Shannon and David to have some sort of reconciliation. Um, I Hmm. always, you know, I don't know why I worry about people's finances. I mean, I don't see how David Bedore, how can he afford all this? Like, I mean, what does David Bedore do? He's in construction. I love talking about people's finances, (laughs) ratings, ratings, and people's finances. I mean, I just listen. I think there's a lot of very wealthy people that are on the housewife show, but like, Candy Burris. And then I think the majority are not, you know, I just Kyle and Mauricio, Diana Jenkins, Miss Burris. I mean, yeah, I don't really understand where David Bedore's, you know, I think Mauricio and Kyle though, they really popped up past five or six years since the show, since him launching the agency since the show. But I mean, prior to that, like, I, I think they were, they probably were millionaires. I don't think they were like, flying private jet like the the life they're living now but and now um, he has his own show on netflix where like all the agents are gonna buying beverly hills we're all it's gonna be like selling sunset once an agent's on that they're gonna be famous people will want to work with them you know what i mean it's gonna be like a win 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 for mauricio and kyle i don't think that means kyle's leaving beverly hills i don't think she will but like you know, I don't think like, I mean, on, 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 on her own, I don't think she's going to wake up and say like, this is too much. That's what I think. I think Kyle might have a tough season, but this is her life. This is her fucking life. And I don't even mean like money wise. I just mean like her life. She's not leaving. Well, I don't, I wouldn't be shocked if Kyle's angling, like if this agency show does work on Netflix, cause I mean, selling sunset, I mean, they're pumping out the seasons. How many, what are they on season seven, season eight? I mean, it's only been six, in- but they green lit six and seven at once, which like that never happens. So look, I mean, I think if Mauricio has success, I wouldn't be shocked if Kyle like walks away and then, you know, and I mean, Kyle, if, if Dorit is demoted, you know, it sounds like PK and Mauricio are in business together to some degree. So do, do Kyle, I mean, now they all have contracts. I don't know how this could work, but you know, the Kyle, Dory, PK, did they all kind of head over towards, um, Netflix? I mean, you think think Dory like earned her keep a couple of weeks ago where she Told you were saying something off air oh. to me, like you thought that was her turning moment of the season. Yes. The scenes where Dory comforted Erica with Diana after Erica like lost her shit on everybody because they were questioning if, you know, why she has no empathy for the victims. And Dory, then then Kyle calling her and saying, if you don't come to the hat place, I'm going to be so upset with you. I'm going to be so upset. And then Kyle, you know, Dory goes. And then after Kyle's still mad at her and Dory talks to her and she's like, baby, we're if we're friends with Erica, we have to help our friend too. And like Kyle's like, but I don't get it. Wait, I mean, yes, I thought Dory is like, you know, this woman is standing in the middle and is like trying to be friends with everyone. And I think calls, she is kind of the one person that can call out Kyle and make 
again, Kyle looked like overly emotional, a brat. I mean, you know, it's like, well, yeah, you know I thought Dorit earned it. You know what? Now you, I'm, the light bulb is something's going off in my head. Well, remember the the best friends, British, British from overseas, Pete Kai and his good friend Lisa Vanderpump and Dorit mm-hmm. and Lisa. If look at if Dorit is smart, if she is smart and she'll do anything, fall on that sword to stay on the show. She, when they come to her and say, we're making our decisions, what's your storyline? She'll say, I'm going after Kyle. And she's going to throw that friendship down the river. If she were smart, that would, that would guarantee her another season. Look at Lisa Vanderpump. I mean, look at real friendships go through it on this show. Kyle and Kyle and Lisa. I mean, I don't think she would do that, but I don't think what a shame, but yeah, if she, or if she were just feuding with Kyle, it would make the show a lot more interesting. It so seems like where Rinna is in the kitchen, put a pen in it. Kyle, Dorit, you're in my inner group. We're the inner circle. It's us with Erica. Put a pin in it, ladies. You know you're gonna now. I mean, if this were Crystal or Air, you know, or or Sutton fighting with Kyle, Rinna will go in and say, Crystal. Now, pipe down, pipe down, girl. You do not speak to Kyle Richards like that. And that is inappropriate. Your point is not valid. This is so, it's like, scenes like that are so just like, this is why people hate these four people together. Like, I'm like, put a pin in it. Like, since when do you want two people not to fight? You stir up and through your best friend, Denise Richards, you know, your soap actress. And she was disposable. She, uh, according to Rena, yes, but like I don't know. It's 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 scenes like that that are just so. It, so you got it, but I still. You're right. Maybe you're right. Maybe Jory will stay. Well, to me, people have made a big deal about this pa- the this recent episode where you know, yeah, they 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 catered to Erica and, um, you know, Dory helped kind of negotiate between, um, Dory and Kyle. Okay. But I mean, to me, that's the difference. I I don't see how this is a double standard to me. You have four women that are actually friends. And you know, the truth is of the matter, Kyle, none of them like Garcelle Sutton and Crystal and Crystal Garcelle and Sutton. I give Crystal Garcelle and Sutton credit because I think those women are coming to this table like, all right, we would be friends with you. And I mean, they do make Kyle and Erica and Rinna and Dorit look like mean girls because I don't think that those four are interested in being friends with Garcelle Sutton and Chris. I don't, I think, and I think they make that very, very clear. You're here for the show. I interact with you for the show. I could care less about your fucking opinion or anything about you. I love Garcelle and Sutton because I think Garcelle and Sutton get it hundred percent and just keep coming for them and coming for them. And they're like, Oh, don't worry. We're going to keep inserting ourselves and we're going to make, which throws Rena off. I mean, it's, it's a great combination, but to me, when people were 